We are here in Amherst. Welcome to Tinker Garden. If you are someone who's been a part of Tinker Garden as a leader or a family, it's so good to see you. And if you've never come to Tinker Garden before, we are so thrilled that you can join us today. And we always start Tinker Garden with the Tinker Garden song. So let's do a verse of Sparrow, Sparrow, Time to Fly. And if you are quiet today, you can just watch along. You can also flap your sparrow wings or you can sing and sing like little kids are watching. So we're going to start out with Sparrow, Sparrow, Time to Fly through the meadow, through the sky. Sparrow, sparrow, time to fly. Come to Tinker Garden. Are we ready? All right, we'll back up a bit. Get our wings ready, and here we go. Sparrow, sparrow, time to fly. Through the meadow, through the sky. Sparrow, sparrow, time to fly. Come to Tinker Garden. Crocodile. Oh, Ivy really wants to do crocodile. And any leader out there knows a surprise animal is always an exciting challenge to come up with the words. So everybody out there, can you make a crocodile mouth? Crocodile. All right, great crocodile mouths I'm seeing out there. And oh, what would crocodiles do? Chomp. They chomp, chomp, chomp. Okay. And what rhymes with chomp? Bump. Bump or romp? Mom. Should we swamp. crocodile? Oh, the swamp. That's perfect. OK. Crocodiles, crocodiles, chomp, chomp, chomp. Moving through the sticky swamp. Crocodiles, crocodiles, chomp, chomp, chomp. Come to Tinker Garden. Now, if you don't know the Come to Tinker Garden song, there are many verses on the blog post about today's live event. And as you can see, Crocodile wasn't there, but we could just create our own for any creature, imagined or real, that we love. So we are going to go next to do what we love the most at Tinker Garden, and that is? Bullfrog. Well, bullfrog we could do next time for the song, but we love to play at Tinker Garden. And Tinker Garden is all about nature and play and connection. And we have to thank you so much during this wild time that outdoor play and connections to community are our lifelines. So to be able to have this with you online today means the world. But we are going to play with a special object, and that is Not a, box. a cardboard box. Yes, we are inspired for our play today by one of our all-time favorite books, Not a Box by Antoinette Portis. We're going to go through and read it right now. Not a box. And this is a book to children everywhere who are sitting in cardboard boxes. Marvelous, marvelous stuff. Why are you sitting in a box? It's not a box. What is it? A race car. It's a race car. <laughs> Cold fingers. What are you doing on top of that box? Everyone can say it with me if you want. It's, it's not, not a, a box. box. It's not a box. What is it? A mountain. It's a mountain. Why are you squirting a box? What are we going to say, everybody? Not a box. It's, it's not, not a, a box. box. What is it? A fire. A, a building that's on fire. It's a building on fire. Time to be a firefighter. <laughs> <laughs> now you're wearing a box. What are we going to say, everybody? It's not a It's not, not a, a box. box. What is it? It's a robot suit. And there's a beautiful robot suit on our Outdoors All 4 group. Boy, is there ever. Are you still standing around in that box? It's not, 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 not a box. Well, what is it then? It's a door. 
Well, my friends, that's exactly the question we're going to be answering all week at home, in our backyards, on our stoops, in parks. We're going to go and we're going to answer what is our cardboard box. And my friends, can you each go get a Nada box? Yes, Mommy. Before we start to play, we're going to show you a few of the things that we've done for fun twists on what it means to play Nada box. And while my friends are getting our Nada boxes, my, my adults, my guides, this is all about something called divergent play. And it's a key part of creativity. And it's all about exploring all the possibilities, being open, being silly, and really letting yourself explore every single possibility. You can read about divergent thinking on our blog, but you can also just lean into it and have fun by asking questions like, what is this? A hat. This is a not a box. <laughs> it could be a hat. It could be oh. a, drum. a drum. What else could it be, Maeve? A boat, um, a boat. It could be a table. A table. Yeah. And if I have little, little people, it could be one of our favorite things at Tinker Garden called a peekaboo box. Oh. And I could put balls inside. So baby could take them in and out just by cutting holes in the box. Ooh. I also could take some golf tees. And if I have some mallets, and boy, can I make all kinds of holes. Would you like to start working on that in the big Nada box? There you go. Um, I can also put pine cones in and out with baby. And if I want to play like my friend the beaver, I could put on my beaver tail. And I could start to build with lots of Nada boxes. And on our DIY activity sheet, you can find out more. Maeve found us some great research on beavers. There's some great research. And our wonderful Megan Recupero can show you how to take cardboard, bo your Nada box, and make beaver tails. All right. So we are going to play a little bit with our Nada boxes. We'll keep the camera rolling. And we welcome you to watch us and join us. Or go get your Nada boxes and head outside or even just head down the hall and start to play. Start to ask yourselves, what could my Nada box be today? And keep rolling, stay silly, stay open. Just keep the ideas coming. It's all about divergent thinking. It's joyful, it's the breath of fresh air we all need right now so, so badly. So huge thanks to everybody who came to our Zoom session watched us love to learn and persist through some real challenges thanks for being online with us get out and play stay outdoors stay safe but keep playing and keep being outside it's our all of us will have it as a lifeline right now and when you play please share uh using hashtag tinker garden hashtag outdoors all four join our outdoors all four group there are already amazing examples of not a box play up there even since we launched our activity. And if you sign up for the Tinker Garden mailing list, every Sunday we'll share with you a new set of do-it-yourself activities for the week. And just saying, next week's going to be fun. So join us, share, get out there. We love you all. We all feel and need to be connected. And we're just so grateful for this incredible community and that we got to start this, aren't we? Big hugs. Virtual hugs to everybody.